Welcome, welcome students. Welcome to EdTech Live. Let's get started. Today we are going to make a map to show different people around the world what they do, what they might eat. Let's get started. The first thing I would like for you to do is to go to this website right here. So you will need to open up a new tab by clicking on the plus button up here and typing in these letters. I will show you plus button. Type in these letters right here, gg.gg slash to map and then hit enter. When your screen looks like this, you've done the right thing. I will put the um, website right here for you. And teachers, you might want to pause right now to make sure that everyone is on. So feel free to pause me if I'm ever going too fast. Once your computer looks like this, you will want to click this button right here that says make a copy in blue. It is a map of our world. And as I read a story to you today, you are going to move these icons over the places of the world where they uh, fit. So I have a book for you to read today. And it is called Kids Around the World. Kids are all around the world. No matter where they live, they are a lot like you. Turn the page to meet some kids from all around the world. If you want to read the book again while I am not here, the link is down here. My name is Charlie and I live in Nunavut. Let's see if I said that correctly. Nunavut. Nunavut. So I can click on the word. Let's listen to it again. Nunavut. Nunavut. It is very cold and snowy here. I go to school in a snowmobile. My family has lived here for many years. I will, I think I will always live here. So this kid lives up here um, close to Canada. And that is in North America. So on your computer, I want you to find the icon for something that we talked about for Charlie. And we're going to move it up here in North America. Now, did Charlie talk about a house? No. Did Charlie talk about a snowmobile? Yes, Charlie. what he say? He goes to school in a snowmobile. So we're going to click on the snowmobile and drag it up top, North America, right there. Now, friends, before we go any further, where do we live? I want you to drag the house icon to North America right here. We live in California in North America. So we are close to Charlie, not too far away. We live on the same continent. Let's keep reading to learn about some more kids. My name is Rosa. I live in Bolivia. Let's make sure we pronounced it correctly. Bolivia, Bolivia. Bolivia, we did. My family keeps goats and I take care of them. My home is very pretty. It is near tall, tall mountains. So Bolivia is right here in the continent South America. Let's go to our map. 
what icon maps Rosa or matches Rosa? The goat. Let's move the goat to South America where Rosa lives. My name is Jojo. I live in Tanzania. Let's see if we pronounced it correctly. Tanzania. Tanzania. We did. Some lions, zebras, and monkeys live near my home. My family has a farm. We grow corn and coffee beans. I like corn, but I do not like coffee. Jojo lives on the continent of Africa. Let's go back to our map. What icon matches Jojo? The coffee beans. Click and drag the coffee beans to Africa. My name is Lee. I live in China. My family has a farm too. We grow rice. I go to school and learn to write. My country was the first to have paper. I use paper when I write. Let's go back to our map. Lee lives in China. Now, China is on the continent of Asia. Which one of these icons matches Lee? The paper. Paper is from China, which is on the continent of Asia. My name is Ava. I live in Afghanistan. My country has a lot of sand. There are tall mountains too. I like it here. My father is a teacher. I go to a new school for girls. I am glad to go to school. Afghanistan is located in Central Asia. On our map, Central Asia is in the middle of Asia right here. We have two icons left, sand or castle. Sand is the one that's connected to Ava, so we'll move the sand over to Asia. We have one icon left and it's a castle. Hmm, I wonder where we're going to put that. My name is Marta. I live in Germany. My home is near a real castle. There are many old castles in Germany. My parents work at a car factory. People around the world like to buy our cars. So Germany is on the country, or in the, or not in the country, in the continent of Europe, it's right here in the blue. So we're going to move the castle over to Europe. Germany is over there. We live in the United States of America. It is a very big country. Many people come from around the world to live or visit here. We are glad to be Americans. The end. And on our map, we don't have any icons left because we already put our home here in North America. Look at our map and see where the things are all around the world. Well, friends, that concludes our EdTech Live for today. Thank you for joining us, and I hope you had a fun time mapping different people around the world. Have a great day. Bye.